Hello everyone, it is Heidi and welcome back to another episode of Baby Name Sunday. Now for today's video, I got you guys over on Instagram giving me some help here as we are compiling an amazing list of some sibling baby name ideas for boys, for girls, for boy and girl pairings, or even just gender neutral name ideas. So we have a bunch of different combinations here, whether you're looking for inspiration for siblings in the future, what names pair nicely together, or maybe you're having twins and you need some twin name ideas. This is an amazing list today, so let's get into it. First off, we have the wonderful pairing for girls, Evie Blossom and Lola Bloom. Now I'm loving the floral elements for the middle names, tying the two together, but I'm also loving the really cutesy nicknamey style names for the first names. Next up for boys, we have Bennett and Barlow. These two with those matching Bs at the beginning, I think they have just such a great flow, but they also have this surname feel to them as well. So for this next one here, we have very magical names. There's three of them together for siblings. So we have Atlas Shy, Solea Violet, and Haven Aurora. These ones all give this ethereal, magical kind of feel, and the meanings means gift of heaven, sunshine flower, or blissful dawn. Piper and Teague, so P-I-P-E-R and Teague, T-E-A-G-U-E. This could definitely be a gender neutral sibling combination here. They're both surnames, but they also have these musical notes to them as Piper is a flute player and Teague actually means poet. For sibling girls, I love these two together. Saley, so unique, and Eastlyn. So S-A-Y-L-I-E and Eastlyn, E-A-S-T-L-Y-N. I am just in love with Saley. I think that is so cute. Eastlyn makes it really fun and kind of tomboy-esque as well. And they both have this adventurous and nature feel behind them as Saley kind of reminds me of sailing and Eastlyn means Eastern Meadow. Boy and girl sibling here, we have Iola and Osric. These both sound like kind of goddess, godlike sounds to them. It means violet or beautiful lady for Iola and Osric means divine ruler. For two little girls, we have Aviva and Zadie. Aviva means spring-like, fresh, and dewy, very pretty, and Zadie means princess. I feel like both of these have this really modern feel to them with a little bit of edginess as well. Next up, we have Miles and Murphy. For these two, you have your matching M's, but the meaning behind them is very powerful for such sweet sounding names. So Miles means soldier or merciful, and Murphy means sea warrior. Sage and Willa, spelled S-A-G-E, and Willa, W-I-L-L-A. This could work beautiful for a little boy and girl, or even two girls. These ones have really sweet meanings, almost virtuous. It means wise one for sage, and Willa means protector. Keeping on kind of the boho-y nature feel, we have Autumn and Laker. Really cute for maybe some fall babies, and Laker means live by the stream which kind of has that water element to it and autumn is a seasonal name I also have lemon and bear she loved these for two boys which I cannot blame her so sweet and lemon means lover and then bear is actually a symbol of protection strength and warmth we're going a little bit more traditional here we have Theodore and Julieta very long and romantic too and Theodore means divine gift and Julieta, which I am in absolute heaven with the sound of that one, means little youthful sky father. Two E names here that are very gender neutral is Emryn and Elliot. So E-M-R-Y-N for Emryn, which is a really unique name there, and Elliot, which is very gender neutral. Now Emryn means very swift, and Elliot means Jehovah is God. This one also matches with those E's, but again, they sound really nice and play well together. Now, here is the time for, if you guys are loving the name list today, please give this video a thumbs up for everybody's name submissions here. I feel like we have a wonderful variety for all name pairings. And then make sure you guys are popping down below maybe some other sibling name inspo. It doesn't have to be for twins or anything like that. It can be just for sibling name ideas. 
I feel like a lot of parents have troubles with that, so leave those down below. Moving on here, we have a pair here that is so sweet for little girls. We have Xanthi and Daisy. So Xanthi is X-A-N-T-H-E, and then we have Daisy. Now these two actually have very subtle matching meanings. Xanthi means golden yellow, and Daisy is a yellow flower. So I like how they have that golden yellow feel to them together, but it, it's very, very subtle. So these ones are beautiful. Another great one here for a boy and girl sibling combo, we have Calyx and Serenity. This flow is incredible. That's like how come I had to add it. And Calyx means chalice, which is a symbol of good company and family. Really great for a subtle virtue meaning. And then Serenity means peaceful. Next pairing here, we have Irish names. So we have Fia and Oscar. So Fia is spelled F-I-A-D-H. So you have the Irish spelling and Oscar, O-S-C-A-R. These two together have really cute nature animal inspiration. Fia means little deer and Oscar means friend of deer. I also have Sullivan and Sutton. I love Sully and Sutton. These ones are just super sweet for little boys and Sullivan means dark eyes and Sutton means from the Southern homestead. Both of these have matching S's and they're both surnames. Keeping up with some more nature names here, we have Tahoe and Lakin. These ones have the lake water inspiration as there's Lake Tahoe and Lakin literally means by the lake. Switching things up a bit here, super cutesy guys. One of my favorites is Minnie and Olive. This is so cute sounding. I think it's so adorable. Has a vintage charm to it as well. And Minnie means of the mind and intellect and Olive means olive tree. Surnames here for boys, we have Henderson and Ellington. So H-E-N-D-E-R-S-O-N, Henderson, so handsome, and Ellington, E-L-L-I-N-G-T-O-N. So both of these are very longer, regal-ish sounding surnames. Henderson means son of the estate ruler, and Ellington means benevolent town. We're going a little whimsical here with Alecto and Astoria. So A-L-E-C-T-O and Astoria, A-S-T-O-R-I-A. Both of these can work for two girls or Alecto could also work for a boy. They're very powerful. Again, that whimsical charm to them. And Alecto means unceasing and Astoria is a place name meaning hawk. All right, I couldn't go on with the list without submitting a few name ideas myself. So for my first pairing is two girls. I love this. It's Okaya, O-K-A-I-A, and Marleni, M-A-R-L-E-N-I. I thought this was so fun, so unique, but it has this really beachy girl feel to it, as Okaya means the sea, and Marleni means bright and beautiful sea. Two K names here, very cute, is Kavin and Kovi. So K-A-V-A-N and Kovi, K-O-V-I-E. This is so unique, again, so cute. And cabin means hollow and Kovi means little bay. So I feel like it's almost like a land inspiration behind the names, kind of where like the land meets the sea in a way. Greek inspiration here for these next two very powerful boy names. We have Archimedes Flint and Isidore Blaze. Lots of strength behind these two. They're both ancient Greek inspired and the middle names match with those nature feels of Flint and Blaze. We're now moving from very powerful to very sweet. We have Renly and Bowen. Kind of soft sounding too. They play really well together though as both of the meanings kind of have this regal ruler kind of feel behind them. Next, we have three girl names here. So we have Treasure, Taylor, and True. With those matching tees are so pretty. And I feel like they all give a different feel amongst each other. You have Treasure, Taylor, and True. 
great flow on this next boy and girl pairing here. We have Bonnie and Hugo. Don't those sound so sweet? They have that traditional kind of vintage feel to them, still a little bit unique. And Bonnie means beautiful and cheerful, very happy. And Hugo means mindful and intellectual. We have Sunday and Nixon, so S-U-N-D-A-Y and Nixon. This is really cool because Sunday represents like the sun of the day, you know, day of sun. And Nixon has this kind of water, magical feel to it. It does mean son of Nicholas, but Nix on its own means night, or it has like this water nymph element to it. So I feel like it's really cool for like sunshine and water. Next is Rory and Oslo. Matching four letter names here, Rory means Red King and Oslo is a place name. Another X name here pairing, we have Xander and Cleo. So X-A-N-D-E-R and Cleo, C-L-E-O. Both of these have very strong Greek roots behind them as Xander means defending men and Cleo means glory. Next up is Sapphire and Solston, S-A-P-P-H-I-R-E and Solston. Very unique, S-O-U-L-S-T-Y-N. These are longer, they're S names, they kind of match in a way, but they also have very spiritual meanings behind them. A sapphire is a gemstone and Solston has this kind of virtuous sound to it from the soul. Two boys names here. We have Dexter and Colby. Very, very cool and modern. Both are very industrious name styles as Dexter means right-handed or skillful and Colby means coal town or minor. Another wonderful vintage pairing here is Odette and Shepard. Both of these two have a very southern vintage charm to them and Odette means wealthy and Shepard means sheep herder. Time for some name combos here. So we have Ocean Heart and Halo Rue, and Rue is R-O-U-X. So both of these name combos, I feel like it gives this beachy, boho-y kind of feel. Ocean Heart means red ocean, and Halo Rue means red halo, but heart also means horse. So that's really cool. You have all those kind of nature elements all tying them two together. Slowly making our way down the list here, guys. I know I have a ton, but just some great inspiration here. Make sure you guys are commenting down below. And if you guys want some more name inspiration, you guys can go check me out over on my Instagram as well. Next, for two girls here, we have Maylee and Emberly. So they have those kind of Lee ending names. They're very pretty and almost like princess-like. And Maylee actually means princess and Emberly means fiery meadow. And to me, I literally wrote this down, they both scream this kind of like feminine goddess vibe to both of them. Another great girl sibling pairing is Greer and Innes. And both of these two have kind of really sweet, kind of unique sounds to them. Greer means alert and watchful, and Ines means pure. Another sibling pairing here for boys that I sent in myself is Osmond and Teller. So O-Z-M-O-N-D and Teller, T-E-L-L-E-R. I felt like this is really like handsome surname, but so cool. Ozzy and Teller, Osmond and Teller. And Osmond means divine protection and Teller means weaver. We have Finn and Aurora, and Finn means white and fair, and Aurora means dawn. So think of this in like light and darkness. Then I have Amira or Amira and Milo. So A-M-Y-R-A -A and Milo, M-Y-L-O. Both of these have those matching Ys and they have this kind of highly regal respect behind them because Amira or Amira means princess and Milo means soldier. For boys, we have Forrest and Barrett. So F-O-R-R-E-S-T and Barrett with also two R's. So you have those matching um, letters together and Forrest obviously means forest and Barrett actually means bear. So it's like bear in the woods. Next up is Copeland and Ophelia. So C-O-P-E-L-A-N-D and Ophelia. Both of these two, I don't know what it was. They don't kind of match in any way at 
all. They just have that longer sound to them and I feel like they basically have the same amount of letters as well. Oh, very similar. So I think that they just sound well together and sibling names don't have to match. If you love, you know, different names, like go with whatever you love. And I think this is a perfect example for that. Two powerful girl names here. We have Starlet Moon and Imogen Ray. Again, a very goddess-like feel coming from both of these. Starlet Moon means Star of the Moon and Imogen Ray means Royal Maiden. I have another boy and girl pairing here. So we have Vigo and Svea. So V-I-G-G-O and Svea, S-V-E-A. Both of these two share matching kind of powerful meanings of war and spear, but they're also very powerful Nordic and Scandinavian names paired nicely together. For two girls here, I added the pair Nola and Zinnia. So N-O-L-A and Zinnia, Z-I-N-N-I-A. I thought these sounded super cute together. Nola and Zinnia. Very happy and cheerful sounding and very playful as well. I have Sunny and Lakeland, S-O-N-N-Y and Lakeland. Both of these have this, again, sun and water type feel because sunny means sun or it means the literal sun and Lakeland means lake by the land. We have Hasten and Radlin, H-A-Y-S-T-E-N and Radlin with the L-E-N ending to match. So they both have those endings in the E-N and they also have very similar meanings as Hasten means town by the meadow and Radlin means red meadow. These next two for girls are incredible incredibly beautiful. We have Maven and Gemma. Gives a very kind of happy, cheerful, again, feel for these two. And Maven means one who understands and Gemma means precious stone. So these two are very kind of sweet, but modern vintage names. We have a pair of word names here next that are very kind of peaceful sounding. We have Harbor and Haven. I actually really love these two. They have this modern kind of boho-y feel, but they also kind of scream paradise. You know, Harbor is just so beautiful. You know, you have the ships and the water surrounding you, but Haven just means tranquil, that safe place, that blissful place. A few more name combos, guys, here. So two Z names here, we have Ziggy and Zaya. And Zaya is Z-I-Y-A-H. I think this is really playful and very fun. Fun. Ziggy means victory and Zaya means light. So I think this makes really great um, rainbow baby names. It's very special with the meaning. You have victory and like the light at the end of the tunnel. All right, so we've made it down to our last four name combinations here and three of them actually has matching first letters. So first we have Tasia and Tavio. Both of these have the same amount of letters. So they both have five letters each. Both begin with T and Tasia means resurrection. Tavio means eighth, and they both have this ancient and Roman Greek variant behind them. They're both diminutives of some really um, great ancient Greek and Roman names. We have Valor and Vivi, so V-A-L-O-R and Vivi, V-I-V-I-E, and they both actually incorporate virtue meanings behind them as Valor or Valor means great courage and Vivi means full of life. Now that brings me down to my last two pairings here. We have Brecken and Bo, B-R-E-C-K-E-N and Bo, B-E-A-U. They're very handsome with those matching Bs as B is a very popular name for boys. Everyone loves a good B name. They're always so sweet. Brecken means freckled and Bo means handsome. So I love those meanings paired together. Then last but certainly not least, we have the really kind of cool pairing here of Onyx and Pearl. O-N-Y-X and Pearl, P-E-A-R-L. Guys, for gemstones, like precious gemstones pairing, I think this is so cool. It's matching modern and very edgy with Onyx and very soft and delicate and vintage with pearl. Also, onyx is a black gemstone. Pearl is like this white ivory gemstone of like purity. I love this pairing together and I think that was so cool to kind of end off the list. 
So that is it with today's sibling name pairings. I know there was a ton, but that's a ton of inspiration for you guys to see what you can really do with sibling names. I mean, siblings can have whatever you want. They don't have to match. They can match if they want, or they can have this subtle feel about them that maybe uh, kind of joins them together in the meaning or within the name. And like I always mention, if you guys are in a rut with names, here's my email right here. I offer one-on-one -on -one name consultations so I can curate a specialized list just for you. So if you have any questions on how that process works, please email me right here or you can send me a DM over on Instagram if that is easier. Take care. I hope you guys are staying safe and I will see you guys next Sunday with another baby names list. Bye!